everyone. So I know it's a little bit late to be doing fall favorites, but I have an excuse. It has been freaking hot all this fall in California. Like, this is the first week it's actually been kind of cool, like I can start wearing my boots again. Like today, the high was like 72. Woo! So during fall, it felt like summer. Like, it was 90 degrees during Thanksgiving. It was so hot. So now that it's December, it's starting to cool off, it's starting to feel more like winter. So it reminded me, I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't do a fall favorites. I should do that. And I have quite a lot of fall favorites, so I'll get right into it. And the first product is Cinnamon Sugar Donut. And it is a candle from Bath & Body Works. And this candle smells so good. Oh my gosh. Mm, it smells like just walking into a donut shop while the donuts are still being made. It just smells so nice and cozy. And it says, share the delight with a homemade vanilla cake donut covered in sugar crystals and crushed cinnamon. It doesn't smell too cinnamon. And what I really like about this is that it's not too sweet. It's very subtle, and I oh, I love this candle so much, and I'm so upset I didn't buy it in a bigger size. I went back to Bath & Body Works to buy it, and they already changed all of their stock to the Christmas stuff. And this was a few weeks ago, and I'm, ugh, I'm really upset because I really like the scent of this candle. Like, I'm not burning it until next fall, so then hopefully they re-promote this scent again and I can buy it. I have another candle for my favorites, and this candle is my absolute favorite candle of all time, and it is the Pumpkin Cupcake Candle. Oh my gosh, I just love this scent so much. I'm a huge fan of pumpkin. I love anything pumpkin, like the pumpkin bread, pumpkin pie, this pumpkin candle. I guess some of the, like the scents that they have is a spiced pumpkin cupcake with rich buttercream and frosted ginger. And this smells so good. Mmm. I know you've probably seen this a lot, but th this really is the best candle ever. My next favorite I was sent to by Vlog Beauty. And I'll link her down in the bottom. She is so sweet. She makes really great videos. And she gave me this Benefit Go Tropicoral set. And this box set is amazing. It has little cards giving you tutorials on how to wear the highlighter and lip gloss and blush. And it comes with a mini cha-cha tint, a mini high beam, the blush and coralista, and then a lip gloss and coralista. But my favorite out of the kit is cha-cha tint. And to be honest, I have never been interested in trying this cheek stain. Like, look at it. It's like this obnoxious orange color. Well, it looks obnoxious, but on the skin, it looks so good. I am now a huge fan of using an orange tint to my cheeks because sometimes when I wear blushes, it almost makes me look like I got sunburn on my cheeks, but by using this orange color, it doesn't look like a sunburn or anything. It looks like a natural kind of just glow to my cheeks. I was so impressed when I tried this on for the first time. I was like, whoa, like, I've never seen my face look like this before. But it looked so good. And I really, really like Cha Cha Tint. My next favorite is a nail polish. And it is the Revlon Nail Polish in Copper Penny. And I absolutely love this nail polish. This is the perfect fall nail polish. It just reminds me of the autumn leaves. And I love how it has the metallic sheen to it. And it has some gold sparkles to it. It is just the perfect bronze. I love this. And Revlon nail polishes are really great quality. It's one of my favorite drugstore brands for nail polish and makeup. And it just goes on opaque with just one coat. You don't need to do two coats. It looks perfect with just one coat. It is such a great nail polish. It's so good. And if you're interested in getting this, during Christmas time, CVS and Rite Aid, they always have these awesome sales on the Revlon nail polishes. So keep a lookout for that. I'm sure during winter time, especially now, with all the sales going on, that they'll have them for super cheap. I apologize in advance, but this next favorite is a limited edition color, and it is the Maybelline Color Tattoo in Barely Beige, 
and I've been using this every day as my base eyeshadow and it is just so beautiful it's just this gorgeous champagne and it's so pigmented it just looks so good oh, it goes on so smooth it blends well it lasts all day I am in love with these color tattoos they are high-end quality they're amazing I highly recommend picking them up they are awesome eyeshadows and this color just made all of my eyeshadows that I put on top of it just pop and they last for so long they honestly do not fade throughout the day um, I usually use a primer before I use them but I have not had these crease they're so easy to blend you have to kind of warm them up with your finger though but then like it goes on super smoothly it blends well this eyeshadow is amazing I have seen them at my CVS still, like they're trying to like sell them out, but if I were you, I would definitely try to find this and buy them. These eyeshadows are super comparable to the Benefit Creaseless Cream Eyeshadows and the Buxom Cream Eyeshadows. These are amazing, amazing, amazing products. My next favorite is from NARS, and I actually got this in one of my 500 point perks from Sephora. And it is the Velvet Gloss Lip Pencil in New Lover. And it looks like this. And it doesn't go on as dark as you see here. It goes on a little bit more sheer, but this is a gorgeous color. And I love the formulation of this lip product. It goes on super soft, but it has like this glossy finish to it. Like, look at that shine. It looks so nice. And it feels great on the lips. It lasts for a super long time. And I'm definitely going to buy this in full size once I run out of it. Because this has kind of become a holy grail item. I, I love this so much. <laughs> now, my final favorite is a lipstick from L'Oreal. And it is one of their The Balms lipsticks and this is in the color Plush Plum and it is this gorgeous berry color I have been wearing this constantly this fall and even though it's called The Balm I don't feel like it moisturizes my lips that much it just doesn't dry them out like a normal lipstick and another plus about this is that it has SPF 15 in it and it's just the perfect fall color. It's kind of similar to that NARS color now looking at it, but it it's also glossy and that is an awful swatch. Oh my gosh, but whatever. And I wore this all throughout the fall and even now in winter. This is a beautiful color to wear during winter time. You know, people are always wearing like dark berry colors. And this one's nice. You can definitely build it up. It is sheer because it has like the balm to it. But it's a great lipstick. I highly recommend it. And now for some fun favorites. I have been obsessed with the show The Walking Dead. I finally got hooked on it this past season. And it is so good. And last Sunday's mid-season finale. Oh my gosh. Like I cannot wait until February to see what happens. I just love it. And oh, I think the zombie makeup is really good on the show and all the special effects that they have. It is so, like, I am obsessed with the show. And I never thought I'd be into this show. Like, really, a zombie apocalypse TV show? Okay, sure. But no, I am, like, obsessed with it. Like, every Sunday, I made sure I had to watch it. Like, that's what I would look forward to on my Sundays. I'd be like, oh man, school's tomorrow. But at least Walking Dead's on. And, oh my gosh, I love that show so much. And as for music, I have been hooked on Marina and the Diamonds. I'll link down in the bottom bar, like, my favorite songs from her. But she is amazing. I love her. She has so much confidence when she's on stage. I love her lyrics. They're so funny. And it just, I don't know. Whenever I listen to her songs, I always feel so much more confident about myself. And she really needs to tour in California. Like, she's been touring in the United States, but it's all been, like, the East Coast 
Texas. She hasn't been coming to the West Coast. So Marina, come to California, please. So that is it of my favorites. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys stayed till now watching this video, thanks for finishing it. And I just want to thank you guys so much for always commenting and sending me messages. It's just really, it's nice to have like a support system and I really appreciate it. Let me know if you guys have tried any of these products and what you think about them. And if you have any recommendations on what um, color I should get in full size for this velvet gloss lip pencil. So again, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you're having an amazing day. Bye.